In this problem, we're going to convert this number, which is in base 5, to decimal form, which is base 10. So because it's in base 5 and we want to convert it to base 10, we can do it like this. So I like to start with this one here, so 2. So it's 5 to the 0 times 2. Okay, that's the first one. So it's always this here to the 0 power, and then plus. Now we're in this place here, so now it's 5 to the 1 times 4, and then plus. Then you go to the next one, and maybe you can see the pattern now. This is 5 squared times 3 plus, and the last one would be 5 cubed, so it'd be 5 cubed times 1. And there's other ways of writing it, and there's other shortcuts you can take, um, but I always think that this is a really simple approach, because you start with this number here, and you raise it to the 0 power, and then you multiply it by this, and then you just increase the power, see, 0, 1, 2, 3. All right, I'm definitely going to use the calculator for this, or for some of it, let's see. 5 to the 0 is 1, so this is 1 times 2, so this is 2, plus... Uh, this is 5 to the 1 times 4, so that's 20, plus, this is 25 times 3, so 75, plus, and this is 125 times 1, so 125. So I'm just going to type this in, so 2 plus 20 plus 75 plus 125, so I got 222. So this would be the base 10 or the decimal form of this number that's in base 5. Again, just always start with whatever number is here into the zero power and then just multiply it by each digit and then just go down the line. Always works.